Hi, my name is Daniel Timmerman and I'm an EdTech Fellow with ETS. Today we're going to be going over the personal voice amplifiers we have available at the library for checkout during class. So on the front of the box we have an itemized list of everything that comes with the kit. When you open the kit, you'll find everything inside as well as a set of instructions included within the kit. This is the speaker and where the sound will be coming out of. There is also a neck or headset you can put together like so, so that you are able to walk around without having to uh, use the handheld mic during class. There is also a handheld microphone that can be paired at the same time as the headset. So you're able to have a microphone on yourself and hand this microphone off to students while sanitizing in between um, so that they can also speak through the speaker. The kit also includes a strap if you want to carry the speaker around, a charging device for the microphones, and a charging device for the speaker. So to pair the microphone first you have to turn on the amplifier. You can do this by holding down the power button. The speaker will then play a tone to indicate that it's on. Emergencies waiting for a connection. Now, let us turn on the power switch on our microphone. A blue light will turn on to indicate it's powered on. Then we will hold down this UHF button. This stands for ultra high frequency. Um, you hold that down and this indicator light will begin flashing. Now we will hold down this pair button on the back of the microphone. And we will know it is paired when this light becomes solid. We can now talk into the microphone to tell that our voice is now amplified. And this neck or headset you can wear around your neck or on your head. I prefer it around my neck. And you can adjust the microphone to wherever it fits best on you. Similarly, you can pair the handheld mic. To do this, you hold down the power button until it turns blue. Then, like before, you hold down this UHF button until it begins flashing. Now, triple click on the power button. It is now paired. And you can hear my voice as I talk through the amplifier. So, now you're able to use both microphones at the same time through the voice amplifier. If you find yourself in one of the larger classrooms on campus, such as the Bandersnatch, the NAP performance space, or you're just unhappy with the audio your remote students are hearing, one good method is to use these voice amplifiers along with the snowball microphone. You can put the snowball microphone more in the center of your students so they can be heard. And then put this speaker near the microphone so that you can be heard even when in the front of the room further away than you normally would be from the microphone. We find this works great and if you want to try it out you can check out one of the many kits from the library and if you'd like to um, try it out, demo it with a ed tech, you can contact the service desk at servicedesk.denison.edu and they can set up an appointment uh, with ETS to get one in your classroom.